be honest to our potential employers that we left our current position because of bad relationships with a supervisor or a boss? What if I transfer internally and my potential new supervisor presses me for details, knowing the reputation of my current supervisor? How do I professionally respond to such an inquiry? So working for someone who's kind of unknown, as this person said, it, this email's a lot longer. She gave me some other details. Um, this person called the boss a soul crusher. <laughs> working for a known soul crusher, it, internally transferring, you may have an executive who wants to know what was that like? What was that relationship like? First of all, I am a firm believer that you never badmouth a former boss ever. In, in an interview, whether it's internal or external, it's not going to ever help you. What you wanna always say is it's not the right fit. It's not the right fit. That is your, your broad, all-encompassing way out of that. You know, It's not the right fit for me and my career. What I'm looking for is, and then define what it is that you want out of your next partnership. What I'm looking for is a partner who really is going to help me develop and, and challenge me in X, Y, Z way. You know, give them some specifics about what you want for the future, but do not relate it back to what you are experiencing with your current boss. If someone presses you on it, what you want to say is, you know, I would never badmouth a boss anywhere. Um, I take my responsibility as an administrative professional very seriously. And part of that is, is holding confidences, you know, in what the relationship was. And so I would never talk about you <laughs> behind your back and I can't do that to my former boss. I hope you understand. That's the way to approach that. This is about your integrity. Do not allow yourself to be lulled into talking badly about your former boss to your new boss within the same organization, you are going to set yourself up for problems. So it's really about establishing that that's confidential and that you really respect that person. Um, you respect them enough that you're not going to share what your relationship was like. It just wasn't the right fit for you and what you want in the partnership and what you want in your career. It's gonna be the right fit for someone though. It's just not the right fit for you. And what you want, be clear about that. So that's my recommendation. I hope it's helpful. I know it's hard. I know it's hard and that you want to share some details so they understand what it is that you've been through. But don't go there. Mm -hmm.